All right, so this is week number four of beginning six count, and we did some solo jazz to start. So uh, new stuff tonight, we ended up doing a jazz square. So where we ended up, our weight was on our left foot. So with jazz square, we do cross, back, side, forward, where we make a little square on the floor. So cross, back, side, forward. We talked about some style in here, cross, and then we do this back. You can kind of sink into your left hip, your right leg straight, and then side, forward, boom, back, back, back. Then from here, we did something called low downs, where with our right foot, we went ba da, ba da, ba da, ba da. So when we do these low downs, if you see it from the front, you can kind of cross like the leg that's out, that arm kind of naturally wants to swoop across. So you can cross and cross and cross. So those were the new moves for tonight. And then we also did uh, some partner stuff. So we reviewed what we did in video number three. And then from there we did a send out. So it looks like this, send out, triple, triple. From here we do, maybe I'll do it from the side. We do this little two hand hold where we can do a couple basics and open. And then we did something called the cuddle. We come in with the follow bear side and then send her back out. And then when you're ready, you can go back to close. So we talked about how the difference between that send out and a tuck turn is, leaves if you're just thinking about your lead here, that tuck turn is rotational where you actually open up your body and close it. The send out is straight back. So the difference for follows is on the tuck turn, you rotate that rock step and on the send out, it goes straight back. So, send that happen. So we're here. Triple, triple. We talked about just having this double hand hold. Whenever I send Aaron out, if we do it from the side, I just kind of follow that arm to get that double hand hold. The basics and open, we just do that footwork right underneath us, kind of relaxed. And then for the cuddle, we just bring them in to our side. And then from here, it's actually just another variation of the tuck turn, just in a different position where we go out and in and around. Last thing we talked about too is that it's a little bit of a funny handful when we get out. You've got two options. You can either just flop it here or you can fix it by doing something like a pass by and it'll just fix that hand. Uh, so once again, at the end there, you can do that pass by and then come back to close if you wanted to. And I think that was everything. Is that it? Okay, great, sweet. I'll put on some music for you guys.